Hello, producers, and welcome now to Wednesday and Lightcast Day. Today's the day when the sun and moon conjunct. It's the new moon, so you won't see the moon in the sky at night. And when the moon goes away, it's time to lightcast. Lightcast your reality out into the world and tell the universe what you expect to have happen. Now, Tauruses are pretty natural at this. You rule value, you rule abundance, you rule money. What that is is the ability to basically manifest. So you already get this, and you can maximize on it if you're really conscious. Now, today with the sun and moon together, it's going to have a greater impact on your wishes. And really, if you invest in one or two areas, I think you'll get the greatest return, Taurus. You like that? Return on spiritual investment. That's a Taurus term entirely. The biggest is really your lifestyle, because the sun and moon conjuncting in Libra is in the house of lifestyle, of daily reality, of health and welfare to yourself. This starts with the, the cells in your body, literally your relationship to your body. So if you're trying to light cast a skinny body or, or a muscular body, whatever you're trying to light cast as far as your actual health, today it is fully supported. Put those in your wish list, put them on your vision board. Also at the same time, I think it's important to light cast your lifestyle. So Maybe you don't want to work 60 hours a week. Maybe you want to work 50. Maybe you want to make more for less. Maybe you don't want to commute far. Maybe you don't want to commute with Bob. This is what it comes down to when it comes to lifestyle. And lifestyle is important because it's the metronome that we kind of make love to the universe with. It's that first 12 feet. And if you're not happy in this space, you're not going to do greater magic. And greater magic is the other intention of the universe because Venus and Saturn, Venus, your ruling planet and the planet of creation, abundance, all right? Venus is conjuncting Saturn, which means we all have good control of our creative ability right now. And for you, it's in the house of soul expression. The universe wants Tauruses to get back to their ideas of true romance, true creative expression of their soul. Get to that plan and make it happen, says the universe. So really, you're in a great concert with getting to your dreams and also bringing it all forth in the common reality. And one last element, which I think ties to the romance part, Mercury up in Scorpio in the house of long-term relationships. You're also thinking at the same time for the right relationship that will go retrograde tomorrow, so it's an important topic to think of. All right, Taurus, that's all we have for Wednesday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. So good.